Good. All right. Hello, everybody. How are you all today? Oh, tired. Oh, you had a bad day. That's no fun. All right. Well, anyways, this song is going to make your bad day blues. Run out the door. Here they go. Run out the door. Ready? Yeah. Oh. All right. <laughs> now that we've got our bad day blues out the door, we're going to sing, or we're going to work on today, Away from the Roll of the Sea. So does everybody remember back to our warm-up um, mm. that we did the other day? The yeah, you see these rhythms on the board that I've read out for you again? Do y'all remember that? Mm -hmm. All right, so I want you to take your music, and I want you to look through it. Just just browse, just peruse through it. Only only focus on the, um, see how like the first verse one says sopranos and all that? Well, when I want you to just stay on the soprano line. Don't look at the other lines, just look at the soprano line, but I want you to look at the soprano line, and I want you to see if you can find these rhythms in the soprano line of the song. So get your pencils out and ready. Okay. There's one at 36. One at thir measure 36. There's a tied eighth note to a third quarter of an eighth. Uh-huh, good. Measure nine. There's measure one. nine. And measure ten. Measure nine and ten. All right. Thirty-two. Double whammies here. Thirty-two. First Good. Uh-huh. Measure fifteen. Mm-hmm. Correct. These are all right. Correct. So what do you think this means? This song has got some tricky rhythms, but they're the same rhythms over and over again. Does that make sense? Do you, do you see how many times we listed measure numbers that were one of these three rhythms, and then that wasn't even all of them. There were plenty more than that that we just didn't get. So, there's a lot of these rhythms in this piece of music. So, why, why do I spend so much time worrying about the rhythm? Is rhythm important? Yeah. Why is it important? If you didn't have rhythm, it would be boring. Mm -hmm. Is it just as important as the pitches or the melody of the song? Yeah, because the melody is Just making sure, just, just making sure. All right, so I know this is asking you to think back a long time ago, but do you remember when we sang Be Still Nightingale? Mm -hmm. Way back when, actually, that was a bit different. Anywho, so what did we talk about in Be Still Nightingale? There were some long notes. And what do we do with long notes? Count. Shape them, count them. So you'll notice in measure um, 12, and 17, and 22, and then definitely at 26, there's some long notes. So we need to take those and shape them into making beautiful music. But, so what I want us to do, since I'm focusing on rhythm here, I want us to um, clap through the soprano line of the song Paying special attention to the measures that have these three types of rhythms in it that I wrote on the board. But we're just going to go from um, measure 8 to measure 18, the beginning of measure 18. And then we'll continue on. Because sometimes the verses change up the rhythms because the words are different and all that. So we're just going to start on verse 1 and we're going to clap it. We're going to take it pretty slow. We're going to go 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. All right. So, what do we start on? What beat do we start on? Uh, two, three, 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 three. Right. So we've got that pickup small. Excuse me. All right. Yes. Like our somebody once told us, all star song we have a pickup or an anacrusis in this music. Woo! All right. Are we ready? So, one, two, three. Ready, set, small. I'm sorry, I started saying small and I meant to just count one, two, three. So let's try that again. So one, two, three, ready, and three, one, two, 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 three. Two, three, one, two, stop. All right. So I hear 
heard some confusion there. Some of it was my part too. I'm going to count one and two and three and so we can hear the eighth note. That's actually going to make it a little easier because some of these rhythms are just bleh. All right. Bleh. All right, so let's try this again. I'm going to count one and two and three and, and we're going to count the ands and focus on those eighth notes. All right, let's, this, I, I have a good feeling that we'll clean everything up right here. So, one and two and three and 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 one and two and. Sorry, I know I did it wrong. That was per that was almost perfect. That was basically perfect. Abby knows what she did. I'm sure all of us were a little confused at some points in time. So. That was amazing. That was so much better than the first time. Partially because I actually clapped some things right that time as well. Mm -hmm. All right. So if we look at that and then we flip over, it's basically the same exact thing, right? It might just change a little bit because of the words, but that's basically the, me the, the rhythm for this piece. So we're going to just sing through the melody on the soprano line. On the soprano line. We're not looking at any of the parts about the soprano part. And we're just going to start out on da first. Mm -hmm. There's some weird words in this piece of music, mm -hmm. but we're not going to worry about that right now. Um, before we start, what do you think this song's going to be about? Because I know you've been looking a little bit at the words. A boat floats in the ocean. You think it's going to be a, a calm song? You think it's going to be really upbeat? Well, the tempo is my God, which is I think it's gonna be more calm. Yeah, yeah. Calm. All right, we'll see. We'll see how you feel. We'll we'll go through the it's first verse. It's got a lot of long held out notes. Mm-hmm. Not that upbeat. Good. All right, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go from measure um, eight, and we're gonna try to go all the way to measure twenty-six to where it has that long held out note. Now I know we just clapped the first little bit. But I think we can try it, and if not, we'll go back and look at it again. All right. You want us on the yes, da, please. Would you like me to play with you, or do you want me to just start it and I sing through it? Okay. Is that okay? Yeah. Yeah. All right. If I if I need to play yeah, the piano, I will. Sure. Let's challenge ourselves. All right. Yeah. Let Let's sight read like the wind here. All right. Before we start, everybody, put your desks behind your chairs. Sit on the edge of your chairs. I know, okay, we chased all those bad day blues out. All right, here we go. So we're coming in on three, we'll go pretty slow. One, and Are we two. saying the word? We're gonna be on da to begin with. Okay. We just want us to get the pitches and the rhythms with the pitches for right now, and then we'll worry about adding the words. We got what we're getting. Blam, blam. One, two. 